hey my lovelies welcome back to my channel i am deep as in my case you don't already know and if this is your first time stopping by my channel thank you so much for stopping by and if you're a returning subscriber thank you so much for coming back so in today's video i'm going to be showing you how i prep my wig without a braiding rack basically all right so it's more like a come walk with me kind of video this was when i was filming at nine i just thought why not film how i prep my attachment basically this is how i just prep it so it's easier for me to pick up when i'm braiding so i don't have to keep going back to the extension to pick attachment so first of all you want to go in with your hair cream very important is what's going to keep your attachment locked in on the strand so it doesn't like that like shedding off okay so i'm just going to go ahead to mix this attachment because this is three colors of attachment i apply air cream before going in to mix it like border okay because it just gives that very smoother appearance so now i'm going to go ahead and start combing the hair and if you can see correctly i'm combing the hair outward this makes it very easy when you're combing actually it just makes it easier for you when you comb outward outward right then combing it downwards okay then you can go ahead to take the bits of attachment and then comb it again and add it to your attachment and then comb again basically okay it just makes your attachment combing easier than when you comb it downwards okay that's what i've noticed and that's how i comb my attachment very effortlessly now okay so what i do normally i do not take a big batch of attachment to cut from because that would just make the attachment get tangled very quickly so what i do is i just take i divide whatever i'm using into a size i feel is appropriate for my hand that can contain my hand without it being a mess so now i'm just going ahead to kind of pick the attachment little by little because that's the size i'm working with so when you're prepping what you want to keep in mind you want to keep in mind the size you're working with if it's not less whatever you're working with you can do it with this method i'm doing so what i'm doing is i'm just laying it down on a flat surface any flat surface would do and because this attachment is not really long i'm just doing it three by three on a row you can go ahead to do as much as possible okay but i'm just doing three by three and also the table is very little and guys what i do now is i actually take i actually make my attachment shorter and then i just add by length when i'm adding because shorter attachments are actually stress-free for me than actually doing normal length or doing a longer length of attachment okay so i'm just showing you guys how i do the placement from an overhead view i hope you appreciate the effort <laughs> okay so i'm just going to go ahead and just place it and you can see i'm going to place this so much and i'm gonna braid with you guys so you see it's still easy for me to pick from anywhere and it won't tangle it's just very stressful um stress-free <laughs> i said stressful it's just very stress-free all right so if you have tried this method before let me know down below if you're going to be trying it out let me know down below okay and let me know if you like this kind of video seeing the process when i'm working just in a part of the process something like that let me know also down below so this is what it's looking like see how full that table is like you can go on and on and honestly as you're picking it's not gonna tangle so i'm gonna go ahead to start braiding my braided wig if you've not checked out this video go check it out it's up okay i'm gonna put the link down below go check it out i'm gonna go ahead to start braiding this is just me braiding the braided wig nothing big or no big deal but i just wanted to show you that you can pick the attachment from anywhere on the table be it the one you laid horizontally or vertically you just pick from anywhere and it's going to work out very smoothly okay it's not going to tangle it's not going to scatter and i just like this method very very well so my lovelies just go ahead to watch me braid this wig and see how i pick the attachment and how stress-free it is all right so i'm just going to let you guys watch the video
So my lovelies, that's really it for this video. Thank you so much for watching to the end of this video. Let me know down below if you have any questions. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Make sure to share, make sure to like and all that good stuff, okay? Thank you so much for watching to the end of this video. And you know, if you're watching the end of this video, you already know you're the what? You already know you're the real MVP. Thank you so much and I'll see you in my next week video. Love you. Bye.